In the heart of Virginia, Toadie Butner, the owner of a local restaurant, found himself surrounded by familiar faces when a friend handed him an envelope. What unfolded brought him to tears as he witnessed the incredible support of his community during a challenging time. Toadie, residing in Eastern Henrico, VA, had been married to his wife, Betty, for as long as anyone could remember. In December 2017, Betty passed away, leaving Toadie devastated and facing significant changes in his life. For the past three decades, Toadie and Betty had run the beloved Pinewood Restaurant together, a popular establishment frequented by locals, including police officers and firefighters. When Betty passed away, Toadie had to make the difficult decision to close down the restaurant, putting an end to 32 years of shared business and cherished memories. Betty held a special place in the hearts of her customers, known for her warm and welcoming demeanor. Henrico police officer Billy Grimmer recalled her affectionate nature, always offering hugs and cheek kisses, even to customers she didn't know well. Betty's passing deeply affected the patrons, leaving them feeling as though they had lost a beloved family member. However, this challenging time also presented an opportunity for the community to come together and demonstrate their care and support for Toddy. The loyal customers of Pinewood Restaurant decided to unite and provide assistance to help Toddy during this trying period. Their first step was to gather funds to cover the expenses associated with Betty's passing, ensuring that Toadie could afford the necessary arrangements without added financial burden. The community's gesture was captured in a CBS 6 video news report, showing the moment Grimmer presented Toadie with the collected donations, along with words of affection. Remarkably, the local patrons raised over $6,000, covering the costs of Betty's cremation and providing Toadie with the means to keep the restaurant open. Touched by this tremendous outpouring of support, Toadie was visibly overwhelmed, expressing his gratitude to the community. With the additional $6,000, Pinewood Restaurant was set to reopen just a few weeks later. To fill the void left by Betty, Toadie's daughter stepped in to manage the kitchen. Toadie was grateful for the generosity of those around him and the opportunity to continue operating the restaurant in his wife's memory. Though he was too moved to speak directly to reporters, Toadie shared his feelings with his close friend, Officer Grimmer, saying, I feel wonderful about it, and expressing his appreciation for his friends, family, and employees. As Toadie stood beside a framed photograph of his beloved late wife, one of his friends, Mike Elliott, believed that Betty's presence was still felt in the restaurant, saying, you can feel her in the room now. In addition to the patron's support, another remarkable gesture came from a local funeral home, Nelson's, which offered Toadie a significant reduction in cremation costs and provided the urn at a lower price. During a time when many would feel isolated, Toadie experienced the love and care of the Eastern Henrico community, demonstrating that he was far from alone in facing the challenges of being a widower.